Hello, I'm Mr. Dapperton. Nice to meet you. Let's start the video. People often say stating that climate change is fake is one of the dumbest things you can ever say ever in your lifetime. Me, I always say, no, saying if we simply give the government even more of our hard-earned money, they could somehow change and manipulate the weather is in fact the dumbest thing you could possibly say. It's modern day rain dancing, but instead of dancing to change the weather, you pay a politician instead, you know, to buy a third mansion. Bernie Sanders, how sure am I about all this? Well, as sure as this video has a warning label on it, you see authoritarians, they don't like to be questioned. They'll say you're denying science, but more accurately, you're not denying science, but scientists whom are funded primarily by politicians and are in bed with leftist government who are incentivized to lie, to continue to get government cheese. Leftists hate to be questioned. Why do you think Alex Jones got sued for a trillion dollars for simply asking if Sandy Hook was staged in a hoax? To be clear, not saying it is a hoax, but asking questions should never get you penalized. All I do know is the parent was seen laughing on the camera literally just mere hours after learning his child just died. Like, right when he got the gut-wrenching news that his child was just shot down, he laughs. He laughs right before the cameras roll. Be, right when he's doing an interview. Like, he went from laughing to crying in literally four seconds. Why the emotional manipulation? What is the purpose? It is odd. That's a little weird. I'm sorry, it is. And we should be allowed to ask questions. Robbie Parker, I assume he's going to come out to the microphones now and make a statement. Uh, looks like the family is there and they're getting ready to make uh, to come to the microphone. So we'll listen up. Okay. My name's Robbie Parker. My family is one of the families that lost a child yesterday in the Sandy Hook Elementary School shootings here in Connecticut. See, it is unquestionably weird, right? We shouldn't be penalized for asking the question. There is endless amount of topics we're not allowed to talk about. Like we're not allowed to question the election. We're not allowed we're not allowed to simply ask if January 6th was orchestrated by the FBI. And we're not allowed to say that uh, climate change is what it is, which is a push for extreme leftism, which is to control free trade, to put a death grip on capitalism. I mean, you can, but your ranking on Google will be nerfed and nobody will see your post. Your account will also be permanently shadow banned forever and nobody can see your content for the future. Denying the poke's effectiveness would get your video banned, for example, and your channel demonetized permanently, like mine, and shadow banned, like mine. I have 106,000 subscribers on my channel, and I barely break 200 views a video. Do you really need more evidence I'm being censored? All for what? Asking questions? The reality is this. The only people who would deny questions are those who have something sinister to hide. If you like this video, share it on Reddit. Twitter with your family and friends. Let's try to stop this bogus and unconstitutional censorship where we can. And please, for the love of God, save this video before it is removed by YouTube.